Welcome back to more Talk of the Challenges of Gerber Shots. It's been about two weeks since I made one of these. And... Not, but that doesn't mean I have, I've taken, like, a vacation. I've been entering dozens, if not close to a hundred, since the last time I filmed one of these. Hey. So, let's start with this. I don't think I've started this type of video for, like, this for a while. But... Trees in black and white, top 10%, and I couldn't wonder, I couldn't help but think, why was that not ranked in, like, the hundreds instead of, like, almost a thousand? And then I looked at the votes and it thought it must have been a speed challenge. Top 10% photos. And I'm not surprised. That is one of my most popular pictures, so that was pretty cool. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I've used a lot of fills. I've been lazy. I entered so many challenges late that I'm surprised I don't have so many keys. Like, it's ridiculous. And swaps. I really don't even have to use this anymore. But a few I probably should have because I've been getting Premiere only like once or twice. But still, that's irritating to me. Oh, that one's done almost. See, like, that would be the perfect time to fill it. Nah. Two minutes left. That's not long enough. That's going to irritate the heck out of me. It's got to go 800 places in 140 seconds. It's not going to. I really hate that that didn't get more. You know what? Let's vote it up real quick. Uh, this is when I got Dare to be Different. That rose was red. I tried to be different by changing the color like all everybody else ever does. And I didn't even... I was 25 away from Elite. Dang it. Yay! See, I stood out in All About Bread, which I'm excited to have joined because that's bread that I actually made. You can see the parchment paper, the poppy seeds. It was a baguette. And it was awesome. And I made it to All Star. Everybody else just took pictures of, like, frickin' bread, like, bakeries. Like, come on. At least cook your own damn bread. And the others were posting muffins and shit. And I'm sorry, those are cakes, not breads, you dumb idiots. I mean, Raleigh. If you're going to join a challenge, at least make sure it's bread. And not just sweet breads, okay? You have to show actual loaves of bread. If I don't know it's bread, chances are someone who's not a cook's not going to know what the hell it is. Okay? It's not bread if you can't see bread the second you see the pictures. Don't join challenges if they don't match. Ugh. Alright, moving on. The next challenge that ended... I haven't even seen these either, so you're all seeing them with me. That was the one that I started with. I think this is the last one. Look at that. Another all-star. Again, blue and yellow, that's a piece of artwork that I did in 2006. A little tidbit. But you see, look at that. 1,200 votes, and it was only the top 1,300 of All-Star, which means 1,305 other people were ranked higher than me in All-Star. It's ridiculous. Very competitive, some of these color challenges. But I love them, because I always get All-Star, pretty much. Like, see, this says single color, and I swapped that, because I didn't really feel there was enough color. After I had looked at it, I think all people were breaking the rules where there was like two or three colors. And it does say single color challenge. And then in the rules description, it clearly states only a single color. Maybe in the picture. Like, I'm, I, I, I think they wanted it to be... Because the color that's in the cover is, is select color of red in a black and white setting. Everyone else was doing, like, black, white, red, green, orange, all in the same damn picture, and not one color was dominant, but it did say that one color could be dominant throughout, but it didn't say you have other colors accompanying it, so I put this pink one, and if you look really close in the corner, there is a little bit of pollen, but it's not enough to distract that this is just a single color, so I think that should definitely win on the grounds that I'm literally one of 10% of the people that actually put a single color in their picture. But who cares? Moving on. Alright. 
Oh, you know what I'm excited about? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. What is it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And my top ten now, I think, has all officially gotten top thirty percent or better ranked. And this one finally has a percentage. I've been waiting for that frog for so freaking long to get a top percentage, and it finally got 20%. I, I think, it personally, it's one of my favorite pictures. So I'm so glad that it's gotten top 10 votes and finally got a percentage. Yep, these all have top, like, 20 or 5. Wow. And this has top 100 rank. 20,000. This one's getting close. 16,000. I like that picture a lot. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Look at that. 1.1 million. Look at that. Nice even. 1.1 million. 1 million, 100,000, 500. Uh, I've liked quite a bit of more pictures. Uh, oh, I figured this out. Remember when I was following like an 80 or 90 and it wouldn't show them? Boy, activity really helped me. I must have scrolled for days. But I finally found all the ones that they were following for me, you know? Not letting me unfollow. Go to activity and you'll just save yourself a thousand years of trouble. Trust me. Go to activity and you can scroll through everybody that you're following. Even if they haven't been active for months or years. And then you can just click unfollow next to them. Hit refresh. Scroll again, hit refresh, unfollow, etc. Uh, look at that. I have a follower for every day of the year. Woo! Okay, important information though. In the next two or three days, I'll be celebrating two years as a guru shot person. And ironically enough, I will have also, this month, I celebrate my one full year on uh, Instagram. But technically, I didn't actually start using it till March, but I downloaded it on the tablet in February. So I might have to make another video for that. Just stating extra information here. Uh, I'll be doing two two videos today. This one and the Guru Shots. Uh, the Guru Shots and the Instagram one. And then I might do some meme stuff and dream vlogs. I'm going to have lots of dreams for a TV series I want to try. <laughs> That's a lot. This is turning into a vlog. Interesting. But, uh, no. Let's check the achievements, because I think I've gotten, like I said, almost 100 since the last time. Oh, what am I doing? That's not achievement. Good lord. Look at that. All my achievements. You know what's funny? No, never mind. I was going to say, I actually have a hell of a lot more than those. But then I realized that these are better than this. So it doesn't matter. <laughs> this is the number that matters. Ugh, that's a dreadful number. But, look at these last few challenges. Ugh, so terrible. These, though, amongst everything. I mean, if you think about it, really, it's not that bad. Ugh, that number sucks, though. Premiere should not be in the hundreds. But after two years, I'll take it. Because you got ten, top 10% in All-Star, All-Star, and Elite. I've done lots of color challenges. I will say this. I'm very sick and tired of seeing tree challenges, wildlife challenges, and red. Could we just cut that crap, please? Because if you can't get, like, top wins because you're stuck in 2000s. There's too many people getting to All-Star because too many people have good pictures that people have seen and like and keep voting for. Same with green. Stop having green challenges. Green, blue, and red. Just stop it. Uh, I'm glad they had like vegetable challenge and locks and change. That one was different. Back in childhood, that one was different. And Fit for Magazine is kind of different. Numbered one's not that different. Uh, Crowded was kind of different. And I want a challenge for this. That one was good because they're all different. But 
the other ones, like, come on. There are other things in the world, you know. And the fruit one. Ugh, let me tell ya. So many people didn't even post it. Fruits. They're idiots. <laughs> pastel needs to stop, too. There's only so many things that are pastel color in this world. Cats, too! I love cats, but please, just cut it out. Come up with new challenges. I want to win Guru, so... Look at that. Cat, cat, cat. Cat, poop, kid. Come on. Alright, I th think... And for rule of thirds, please stop the single tree in the middle of nowhere. That is exactly what everybody posts every single time, and it's so boring. That's another reason I use autofills. I'm getting so sick of voting for the same crap over and over again. Because people post the same damn trees. Like, it's not interesting. Stop posting it. Alright? This is me just complaining and scrolling through all my ex... I think this is where I left off. Oh, what's this? Ugh. Hey, but that is better. I will admit that's better. I, I voted for it last two minutes, and it went up 700 places. So I'm, I'm happy with that. I'll be top 100 in Premiere. I'll take that. Because I know that picture is phenomenal. It's beautiful. It's awesome. It's a peony close-up in black and white, sharp contrast. It's fantastic. It deserves better than that, but I just didn't vote, so it didn't get exposure. Perfectly fine with that. Yeah, this is where I left off. I would definitely remember that being in the last video, so... Not bad. Only three or four premieres. The rest are all top 30, 20, all-stars, elites. Not bad. Okay, so you're all caught up. And you see my new score, you see my new things, you know that I have more followers, uh, pictures. I went through and deleted like 20 or 30 pictures, by the way. If they didn't have someone's guru pick or a heart or something, like people's likes then i got rid of them they didn't have too many votes because it doesn't affect your score so go ahead and go through your pictures if you have crappy stinkers that you don't use for a year and a half or something just delete them no one cares you got to keep your portfolio clear and clean and crisp and new and refreshed and everything uh okay let's go for challenges that i'm going to join next because i've only i think i'm only entered in two and I gotta do daily request stuff so I can... Daily reward so I can get more fills because I just used it on the dog one because it's only got like six hours left. Okay. They need to change this. I'm, I'm having a little issue here. I'm getting kind of bored liking other people's photos. See, they want me to like five every day. So what I've been doing... This is a cheat. Maybe this will help them change requirements for the rewards, but... I go back in my likes, unclick the heart, and then click it again, and it counts as a like. Cheating, but if you're going to make me do the same damn thing every day, I would have liked a thousand people's pictures by now. And to tell you the truth, I don't like everybody's pictures, okay? I like what I've liked. I've liked less than 200 in two years. Leave me alone already. And having to join a challenge and reach elite, uh, that's what I do every single challenge except for one or two here and there. So can you change that to all-star maybe? Or, I mean, give me some motivation. And then a couple, I get it. They want to boost voting. It's important. Clearly, because I'm out of fills. But change this up or add another one. Add like five or take away one or I don't know. You know, spice this up a bit. But you're doing good upgrading your site, whoever the heck does it. So let's just vote for people's things after we see what's open. Do -do 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 -do. Got lots of energy. I got lots to film today. Alright. Well, let's do this. I'm seeing a couple new ones that popped up recently. I honestly think there are just 24 hour challenges. That are speed challenges, and I hope I didn't miss this one. Shouldn't have a key on it. Because I do like eye stuff. I have really good eye pictures. See, now, I don't really know. I didn't see that one.
So why isn't there a thing? Why is there a key over it? If it's a speed challenge, it shouldn't have a key. I'm going to click it and just see. I'm not trying to rhyme. Trust me. I'm just... I'm a little curious. I, I'm going to unlock that. Because I like I ones, but I didn't see that. I've been following challenges. See, these pop up in the last... What is that? 11, 12, 13? No. It's 11 hours. 11 hours. I didn't see that 11 hours ago. I was awake at midnight looking at challenges. And I didn't see that. So there's no way this is a 24-hour challenge. So how did I miss it? I think some of these challenges are just so wonky. They need to get rid of speed challenges, to be honest. I mean, they don't need to have week-long ones or two-week-long ones or month-long ones, but they really need to get rid of some of these key. I mean, it's ridiculous. It's just trying to get us to buy more keys. At this point, I don't care. I still dominate on, but I still haven't won anything. So I think they need to just get rid of this stuff. But I really do like eye stuff for challenges. I think it's the one of the only good artistic things that you can do with photography is the eye. Because everybody's eye is different. But when you do it in black and white, they're similar, but still different. And that's what I love about the human eyes. They're awesome. And not just human eyes, animal eyes. But uh, I want to see the window. You uh, show me your eyes, what, whether natural or retouched, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Well, mine's not going to be retouched because I have beautiful eyes. Thank you very much. All right, here we go. I would just like to take the moment to complain a little more again. That not only for the 10,000th time has it requested stuff for me to enter a challenge. But dog challenge. It freaking requested a picture of me for a dog. I look nothing like a dog in the picture it's even suggesting. Which is me out in the wilderness by trees looking at my face they think i'm a dog maybe it's my hair maybe it's something but i do not look like a freaking dog so please stop requesting <laughs> that i am a dog okay i am not entering dog challenges with my picture i will lose <laughs> and people will say off task off subject or whatever so just cut the crap okay girl shots learn to suggest better now which one of these do you think would do it guys cat eyes Frog eyes, niece, or a whole bunch of me. Hmm. Bird's eye. I don't think I have any bird's eye ones, but... Hmm. You know what? I really like... It's between these two. I really like my brown eye there. But I really like that one, too. Because you can see the reflection of the forest in it. And the eyelash is awesome, too. Hmm. Let's go with this one. It's perfectly centered. I like the orange hoodie with the gray gray hoodie with orange trim. I like a little bit of the eyebrow. I like that there's no crusty bits like sleep. It's a good picture. I'll th I'm very specific about an eye picture. And that's pretty good because it's straightforward and this one's kind of slanted. So we'll do that. Submit it. All right. Get a person that looks like a guy you would see on the street that isn't homeless. Not that there's anything wrong with that, but let's face it. That does not belong in photography every single flippin' time. So what I'm going to do is post a normal picture of a guy that has not got eight feet of hair on his freaking face. Okay? That's not art, that's not cool, that's not photography, that is just lazy. Get creative, people. That's not a male portrait. Alright? Alright. Alright, I just joined three more challenges, and this is one of them, which just happens to be one of the daily rewards challenge things, so I figured I would show myself voting for some pictures to help boost that and you have to fill this tank down here if you haven't done it yet we're gonna get another foot of snow this week too so on top of the half a foot to eight inches we've already gotten Ooh, that is super cool is that a log that's neat 
a log trough thing for a well pump. That's awesome. That doesn't look cold. That just looks weird. Uh, that's interesting. Oh, those are probably leaves. I was like, why would there grass where it's snow? Never mind. That looks cold. I rarely vote for mountains when it comes to like winter or cold because let's face it, there's snow on mountains 24-7. 365 days a year, that is not winter, okay? Just because there's snow does not mean it's winter, people. It snowed in April and May here in Iowa. So let's face it, if it snows in the Midwest and there's snow in the mountains, it don't mean it's winter, okay? So post different pictures because people that post pictures of mountains get higher votes. But let's face it, not everyone lives within a mountain range, okay? So just call in these. Ugh, please. Please stop this little stupid glass ball orb things. You're not an oracle. You're not a mind reader or a hand reader or gypsy. Please just stop it. It looks so stupid. And I'm sorry to put you people down, but this crap gets so old. It, everything looks exactly the same if you put this in your picture. Every single one of the pictures look exactly the same. Like you're looking through a magnifying glass and it's crap. Crap, crap, crap. So please, if you have one of these glass ball things and you think that's a cool picture, cut the crap. It's not cool. Just stop posting those pictures. They're not good. They are not good and they sure as hell aren't good in every single challenge. And there's always one of you out there. You know who you are. Stop doing it. Very few things I will tolerate and vote for in photography, but orbs that look like magnifying glass, I mean, that just, it's not one of them. It's terrible. You know what this looks like? This looks like they took a picture of the same spot twice, because that looks like spring, but then the clouds match, so it looks like there's more of a green hue to it, so that would have been a cool shot to take. Take a picture of, like, springtime, and then cut around carefully, and then put the winter scene over it. That would be a cool image. I'm getting ideas for Photoshop. I better hurry quickly scroll away before I actually do it. <laughs> All right, we'll go to those because that's really cold. Ooh, look at the cars. Those are covered. That's cool. You know how this happens? I am a meteorologist buff here, but this happens when it gets super cold and there's a lot of moisture in the air and it clings to all the branches like say a fog or a mist super thick like when there's fog warnings out and then the sun rises rapidly and it's still above freezing but all that moisture is still trapped on these branches and it makes them look like frosty little you know cotton looky trees like fluffy it's fog frost fog frost covered everything is beautiful especially this time of year and especially around the Midwest. So I like those pictures. I always vote for them. These are just thick snow, but that's fog frost. Fog frost is awesome. Or mist frost. Either way, they're really cool. But I've, like these, over a river, that's beautiful. That's cold. That's awesome. All right. Let's submit these votes because I've filled my tank and my boost meter's up a little bit. And again, another little tip for voting. Click continue voting and watch that meter go from two to it should go. Look at that. Went up a whole slice and a half. Continue voting and it gives you a higher boost. Secret. Cheat. Whatever you want to call it. But. Wow, what is that? That's cool. An ice. Jargs. Berry bush. That's nice. All right, that's enough. I need to vote for other things, boost other things. I got a lot of other stuff to edit in videos. Blah blah blah. Do 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 do. So, I've entered only three challenges. I might enter some more. And what am I mean? Might I'm gonna keep entering until I'm dead, probably. But um. I've already gotten premiere on all three of the challenges I've entered, which is awesome. I haven't even voted for those yet, but that one I have. These enter. Exit soon. 
Yeah, I'm only interested in the other two ones. Suggestions. That's a weed, not a flower. See, sometimes they're off on the suggestions. But that's all right. Well, I'm just going to keep voting for the daily rewards thing. And I will see you guys next time for more Photographer Challenges Girl Shots. Oh, look, that's almost to 24 hours. All right. See you next time, guys. Bye-bye.